Hello friends, welcome to our YouTube channel Masatax. Today's topic is how to create charts in Excel. After watching this video, you will be able to create charts like this. To make a chart in a spreadsheet, we need a data table. So select the area to insert a data table. Select OK. From this table style menu, you can choose different type of table. For this now, select OK. We have successfully inserted a table and rename the column name. Change it to student name and then press OK. Now select B column and change it to obtained marks and then change the second column title to obtained mark now input your data in the table in the first column type some students name we are including some students name in column a Now in the second column, include their obtained marks out of 500 like this 499, 294, 356, 349 and 456, 452 and like this you can input any number as your data list. Our table is ready now. Now we can insert a charts in this area. Select the table and try to sort the data in any order. Select the option button and select sort A to Z or Z to A. And Notice the difference. You can short your data ascending and descending order. From here you can rearrange your data smallest to largest or largest to smallest. Changes will be displayed but we don't need any change so will clear this to get the original table now select the complete table and go to in chart tab then select column from charts menu select column options from this drop down menu your column chart is now ready You can easily resize your chart from charts layout drop down menu. Click here to design your charts and from this area you can select any style of your charts. For more option press here and choose any design and you can so any charts layout from this area from charts layout drop down menu so as your requirement to change the axis titles type obtain mark and then select here and change it to student name now select the charts and 
clear it then select the table again and go to the column and insert a 3d chart replace it to the left and select the table again go to the insert tab and select pie chart This is the pie chart we have created. Replace it. In the same process, you can create two different column charts at a time. So we need a different column for this new charts. Add percentage as a column and calculate the percentage out of 500 mark to calculate the percentage select the cell and type equal then select the obtain mark cell and multiply with the with 100 mark and then divide it by 500 mark and then press enter now select the complete table and again go to the insert tab and select the from charts layout drop down menu blue columns are representing obtain mark and the red columns are representing percentage thank you for watching